What is up you bunch of legends? I am Red Nitrate and welcome to my Red Dead Redemption 2 Story DLC Gang Hideout Guide. Today featuring the Del Lobos Gang at Gaptooth Breach. We're coming in from the northern entrance. Uh, you can uh, go the southern entrance if you prefer, but I figured going in this way would give us more of the high ground. Um, and yeah, this is one of the two new gang hideout locations that was added to the game back uh, in November last year when the PC version was released and only added to consoles in the last few months at about uh, the start of 2020 thereabouts. Um, so we can see that there's a guard over in the watchtower there, so I figure that's probably a good place to start. <laughs> so, that's that. I saw another guy over in this direction. Let's go take care of him. Look at that. Alright. That's him down. <laughs> We've got a little path through here. Let's see if we can't follow that around. Jeez, lighting up everywhere. Alright, uh, that's that. <laughs> shot him in the face while he was down. Oh dear. Oh dear, come on, that's not the time to reload. Oh, come on. Oh, stop reloading at the worst possible time. Alright. What's that? Oh, hello. Oh. <laughs> Just before he got his shot off. Alright. Jeez, this is, um, I heard this was a tough one, so... Definitely want to be careful. Let's make our way up here. Ooh, looking alright so far. Get out down this way. Oh, hello. Someone coming in behind me. Oh no! Get off me, son. None of that. Can't be having that. Oh, come on. Oh, yeah. oh, it's getting all glitchy, the controls. There we go. Someone. That's you down, trying to sneak, sneak you in there through the window. Can't have that. There you go, that's you down. explosion for everyone, but you had to go and ruin it, didn't you? You just had to go and ruin it. That shotgun shimmer. Come on. There you go. Gee, he took a few shots, didn't he? Mm. Let's just take care of that. So we don't get any 
unwelcome surprises. Yeah, I think shotgun's definitely going to be the way through here. We'll check for loot after we've cleared these people out. I just want to stay focused on the job. Come on. There you go. Let's just sort of clear out this. Alright. Okay. So we've got a bit of a got a bit of a cave in here. Well, let's just uh, loot these peeps first, and then I'll... I'm not sure if you can actually get through there or not, but I'll get this loot, and then I will throw a dynamite stick at it, and we will see. Um, right, dynamite... Because, yeah, this might just be the, the end of the game. But, just in case... Throw a couple of sticks down there. Nah, I don't think we can get through there. Alright, so we've gotten some good loot from these people so far. Let's see if this continues. A bunch of gold nuggets. Oh, I'm loving that. So the loot, especially on these guys down in the down in the mines, seems to be especially good. Definitely worth a look. And then we'll also come out and just check a few of these other, you know, bodies and buildings to see what else we can find. Because often these gang hideouts they they have pretty good loot. Um, it, it's worth checking out at least. No, well we can't get in there. Um, let's see if we can, can we get in through here. Can we get in the? Nah, it doesn't look like we can get in the building here. Oh, yeah, definitely looks locked up tight. We'll check this body here. Platinum pocket watch. Watch, not watch, but yeah, platinum pocket watch. <laughs> I won't turn that down. They're worth decent money. What about you? What do you got? Gun oil. Not especially worth it. I'm not really seeing much in here. So we'll just keep having a little look around. Loot this this gentleman here. Silver ring. So yeah, look, some of them have got got pretty decent loot. Oh, oh, now we're talking about this is what we're looking for. Look at all the money, y'all. Hell's yeah, fifty dollar bundles. Give me that Skriller, baby. Hell yeah. Is that 150 so far? Jeez, bit over 200 bucks. That's crazy. Oh, that's really good money right there. Anything else in here? We got a we got a cabinet. I mean, look, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna sneeze at 200 bucks if that's um. That's all that there is in here. I'm I'm perfectly happy with that. Uh, that looks like it's it's about it. Um, so we'll go up finally and just check uh, the stuff that was just a little bit higher up. So let's just go up here, make sure that we're not missing anything. So I'm getting the vibe that all the, the best loot from the people that you kill um, on the actual bodies is probably the ones that are down in the mines. Because I got a bunch of gold nuggets from them, but I'm only sort of getting little tiny bits of money and trinkets and, yeah, half full potions and stuff. 
So, I mean, look, I always say loot, loot everything that you can. Uh, you don't get much for nothing in this game. So, do check them all, but I'd say the most valuable loot will probably be on the people in the mines, in the actual mine shaft itself, and then in that room, uh, second story room that I visited, where we got the 200 plus dollars. <laughs> we may as well check this bloke. The guy that started all the mayhem, we took down first. So, I think that's pretty much going to cover... Oh! <laughs> Um, I was going to say that pretty much covers things, but then John just completely forgot how to use a set of stairs. And yeah, so I think that is probably a fairly momentous place to leave it. Let's just make sure that we're not... Nah, not missing anything in there. So yeah, I think this is probably a good place to leave it. Uh, on that very dramatic but <laughs> entertaining fall from our boy John here. So, um, yeah, if you did enjoy uh, my gang hideout guide, please hit the like, down uh, like button down below. And if you want to see more content like this, please also consider subscribing. Those sort of things really do help out the channel a lot. And I will catch you all on the next video. I am Red Nitrate. Stay legendary, everyone. Bye now.